Hi folks, this is Chris with Protovoltaics giving you a quick update on the progress we've made with our automatic pick and place feeder prototype. Here you can see the full layout of the feeder prototype. We've tried to keep it as thin as possible. Here you can see the bi-directional communication lines that allow status and command messages to go between the feeder and the host PC controlling the feeders. However, in this demonstration video, we're just going to repurpose one of the push buttons on the circuit board to demonstrate the feeding operation. Again, remember folks, this is only a demonstration video and obviously not intended to be normal operation of how this feeder would usually work. Typically, these push buttons would only be used to assist in getting the tape in through the guides on the feeder mechanism. And obviously, you'd want them to run continuously for that type of operation. However, right now, we're just using them to demonstrate the feeding operation. We haven't even gone through the trouble of calculating the number of steps required to really advance the tape by one position. Also, during normal operations, you wouldn't have it connected like this where you're pulling the tape back against the end guide and the feeder. Obviously, you'd want to pull back the tape against something farther out in front of the feeder. So that's it. You can see the basic feeding operation works pretty well. Obviously, we've got some calibration and some additional firmware to write, but in principle, the feeder works really well. Thanks for watching.